Hi, Stevie. Yeah, every year at E3, we get to see the latest and greatest in gaming. And last year, it's kind of hard to upstage because, of course, Xbox One and PlayStation 4 were announced. But this year, it's pretty cool, too, because it's all about the new and hottest games and also different ways to game. And right below me, you can't miss this, baby. This is from Activision. This is Skylander's Trap Team. Now, Skylander's I love because, well, first off, if you're a parent, you're already very familiar with this. You're like, oh, yeah, got all those figurines in my home. These are new ones, and they're coming out October 5th. Skylander's is known for bringing toys to life in the game. And now with Trap Team, it kind of reverses that. It's going to bring toys out of the digital world and into the physical world with brand new portals. So here you are playing the game. You get to capture villains and then try to turn them into good guys. But I love how Skylanders franchise has really changed the way that kids game in general. So again, stay tuned to that. October 5th, Skylanders Trap Team. And when we talk about new ways to game, check this little baby out. This is a micro console. This is Mojo from Mad Cats. Now what's interesting about this is of course we know Xbox, PlayStation 4, Nintendo Wii U. This little guy, a micro console will be named because of its size. It's got a little competition to those big guys. And what's interesting is this is available now for $200. It was teased at E3 last year. And it is made to play Android games and also PC games. So right on this unit you can play Angry Birds, Grand Theft Auto. It also has the capability to showcase 4K content on, on the screen. So how amazing is this that you can hook this up to an HDMI cable and play your games right there. Also, it's kind of like a media hub. Netflix and Hulu right on the mini, the micro console. So you can get games, you can get apps, you can get media all right on this little device. Something new to stay tuned to. Mojo from Mad Cats. And last but certainly not least, let's talk about virtual reality, which has become huge in the gaming space. And notably, Oculus Rift is a big player in that space because they sold to Facebook for $2 billion. Now, Oculus Rift is a virtual reality headset. It looks a little nerdy, but it's awesome because it gives you this totally immersive experience. And there's a lot of companies out there, one notably called Real Effects, that is creating custom content for Oculus Rift so they can put you right inside a concert without even having to be there. They can put you on a car lot and allow you to walk around the car, check it out, the interior and the exterior before you purchase, or even put you in a scene in a blockbuster movie to allow you to reenact it. So companies like Real Effects are on the forefront of creating new content for Oculus Rift. Stay tuned, it's gonna be an exciting year in gaming, Stevie, and I, I personally, as a gamer, I'm very much looking forward to it.